Good afternoon, this is Bob Itino coming to you from the CME Group trading floor in Chicago. Talking FX, let's talk about the yen. The yen really has been the strongest of the major currencies, up three consecutive days and four of the last five, despite the dollar strength that we've seen against all the other majors and the strength in the dollar index. Futures jumped up to, March futures jumped up to 92.75 on the high, and the cash went all the way down to uh, 108.16 today. So very strong performance on the yen. It has been the strongest of the major currencies. The economic expansion in Japan is behind it. That expansion continues. Japan is now on track, sort of quietly, for the sixth year in a row, if 2018 ends up to be a positive year, that'd be the sixth consecutive year of growth for the Japanese economy. And again, that's been very quiet because the growth hasn't been stellar. It hasn't even reached 2.5% on GDP in terms of increase of GDP, but it has been a steady recovery, steady and slow. And the Bank of Japan has not really wanted to step in and adjust asset purchases or adjust rates. So it's surprising that the yen continues to gain strength. The obvious reason is that the market thinks that the BOJ is a little behind the curve given the expansion and the continuing strength we've seen in the Japanese econ economy. Even recent data continues to be strong. Japan had strong business conditions on the last release of Japan's coincident index. The coincidence index rose to levels it hasn't seen since 1985. The index went up to 120.7. 1990, at the height of the Japanese economic bubble, it was at 120.6. Now, clearly, we're not in an economic bubble in Japan. Again, it's been very, very strong on a consecutive basis in terms of growth, but the growth levels haven't been great. But that coincident index encompass, encompasses business uh, growth, business spending, business confidence, capital expenditures, uh, businesses that are def definitely confident that the expansion in Japan will continue, and this is adding strength to the yen. So again, the yen up about a half a percent. This is Bob Aichino talking FX futures, specifically the yen from a snowy Chicago at the CME Group trading floor.